What's up guys, my name's Dustin and I'm gonna turn this into this. All right guys, so welcome to week six of turning $10 into an Aaron Tippin 1911. So when we left off, we had $243.49 in the funds, but we sold a few things. So first off, we sold Say Yes to the Dress on DVD. This sold for $8 on Macari and it gave us $6.47 after fees. Next up, we sold the Starbucks shirt, the 50th anniversary. This sold for $5.99, giving us $4.80 after fees. Then we sold Twin Sitters on VHS for $20, giving us $16 after fees. So we're going to get this stuff packed up and I will see you in the next clip. All right, guys, so it's the next morning. And after doing the math, we have $270.76 in the funds after selling those items. So me and my little brother here, we're going to run to the post office, drop some stuff off. We're going to hit some thrift stores and see what we can find to sell on the challenge. Pair of Brooks right here for ten dollars. We're gonna be picking these up. Really good tread on them. Another one. They had a T-shirt that was vintage on a Russell tag, uh, but the back, like the number, was coming off of it, so I left it. We got vintage Tommy jeans. Large. That's good. Adidas foam runners for 75. So I found Rock Band 4 for $4. This goes for about 35 to 40. bucket hat for two dollars and they sell for twenty dollars plus shipping so i'm gonna grab that i was looking at this there's a listing for seventy dollars but the only one that sold went for 13 plus twenty dollars shipping so probably gonna pass on that So this Goodwill, I found this uh, vintage Blue Jays hat, new with tags. Uh, it needs to be clean, but you can take the tag off still and uh, clean it up. So I'll try and do that. So I found these vans, or Austin found them, but I think they're worth about $25. There's seven here. Found a vintage Auburn shirt. Uh, really thin material, but it's a size large, made in the USA. Not sure what it's worth, but uh, oh man, I think it's gonna be $4.99. We may not get this one. I found this NASA helmet and I found one sold on eBay for $30. So we're gonna grab this for two.
So I found this. It goes for like $10 on eBay. And then I saw this. If I can get it out. This is like $15. He's climbing in your windows, he's snatching your people up, trying to rape them. So y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband because they raping everybody out here. Inside of Plato's Closet. I'm thinking about getting these. They're brand new. $65 Mac Miller vans. So I decided to leave those Mac Miller vans. They were $65. There's two listings. Uh, one's on Etsy for like $170. One's on this other website for $149-ish. Uh, I don't know. I just wasn't sure if they would sell. There was no sold comps on eBay, so... I left them behind this time, but if I missed out on something, let me know, because I'd like to know. I can always go back and get them, maybe. So they got this Michael Jackson Wii, uh, the experience. It's in here for a dollar and it's worth about 25. So inside of here, I found this 2010 Stewie shirt. I got that tag. And Austin found a new with tags Jordan uh, kids shirt, so we're gonna pick these up. So far, the only thing that we found for the challenge is this Wally blanket. I think I can get like maybe $15, $20 for it. One more thing, I found this horse. I'm pretty sure it's from He-Man. Um, it's $3.99. All right, guys, well, it's the next day and I've already done all the math. I've got most of the items listed. There's a few things that I need to get cleaned up and ready to take pictures of. But the total amount of money we spent yesterday was $53.98, leaving us with a grand total of $217.78. That's where I'm gonna end this video. Uh, I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had a little fun along the way. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That's it for this one. I'll see you next time.